Hi, boys and girls. This is an example of a metric liquid volume conversion. So we'll again use this metric conver conversion chart, but we will have a different problem related to liquid volume, which is how much space a liquid takes up in an ob in an object. So for this problem, we have Talvery and she bought 15 liters of soda for a class party. How many milliliters of soda did Talvery buy? So our important inf information is that Talvery originally bought 15 liters of soda. And we want to convert liters into millilit milliliters. So looking down here on my metric conversion chart, we know that our liters is our base conversion right here because it's meters, liters, and grams. So we have liters right here. And that's our base conversion. Now, are we going to a bigger unit or a smaller unit? Well, we have milliliters. Well, here we have kilo, hecto, deco. Then we have our base, deci, centi, and, and milli. Well, here's our millimeters right here. So we are actually going one, two, three conversions smaller. So we're going from a liter to a milliliter. So we will be multiplying because we go from big to small. So my equation would be 15 liters and we're going to multiply by 10, 100, 1,000. So we're going to multiply 15 by 1,000. And that's going to equal some amount of milliliters, okay? So when we do this, we know 15 times 1, that's a bad times sign, there we go, times 1, which is right here, so we have 15 times 1 is 15. And then we have to add 1, 2, three zeros into my number. So I'm going to put a comma. One, two, three. So when we multiply 15 liters times 1,000, we get 15,000 milliliters. So 15 liters in this problem equals 15,000 milliliters. So, so Talvery ended up buying 15,000 milliliters of soda for the party. All right, there's your example of that one. Good luck, guys.